Hey, uh, you guys mind if I hang out for a while? Uh, maybe you'll think of some advice for me or something. Uh, sure, why not? Finn, I know there's got to be a way to use all this to defeat Combustor. We just have to figure it out. What? Use somebody else's misery to accomplish our mission? Hey, guys, maybe we should think about pulling an all-nighter on this one back at your place. I got a lot of stuff to work out. I'm in. Gotta really sink this fence post deep to make a geyser. One geyser coming up. Now we gotta get Ice King to freeze it. I don't know what it is, ma'am. I mean, I'm a fun guy. Not, not a fun guy, like a mushroom or something. <laughs> that would be nasty. Um, I don't know, man. Some people are just gonna be alone forever, I guess. Alone? Forever? <laughs> Good work, man. We only need one more. Gotta really sink this fence post deep to make a geyser. Now we got a geyser. Let's trick Ice King into freezing him. Maybe I come on too strong. You think that's it? Maybe I should find a more subtle way to kidnap the princesses. Something more romantic. Or maybe you could just lock yourself up in the Ice Kingdom, cut yourself off from the world, and become a fanfic writing hermit. You'd be great at that. Oh, you're right. I won! Man, that was pretty harsh. We needed another ice column, dude. Sacrifices had to be made. Aw, uh, talking to you guys isn't helping at all. I'm gonna go talk to Gunter. He's a much better listener. Have you guys figured out what to do? Yeah, we're gonna trick Combustor into smashing his head against these super hard frozen geysers. Not even his super thick skull will stand up to that. That just might work. All right, guys, here they come. our work here is done. This is about all the treasure we can carry. Flame Princess, don't worry. We already took down two of those guys that were after you. One more and you're safe to go back and rule the Fire Kingdom. You guys just don't get it. Those other guys might have been tough, but they're nothing compared to Leroy. Okay, so tell us about Leroy. Leroy is the most experienced flame guard in the Fire Kingdom. He served and helped to overthrow seven different rulers. He's only ever been loyal to my father, and he's sworn to make it his mission to remove me from power. So if this Leroy guy is so tough, where is he hiding? He's not hiding. He's just taking his time. He knows there's no hurry because no one has ever defeated him. He's still a little ways off to the east. I guess you better give us the scoop on this guy's weaknesses. That's just it, Finn. As far as I know, Leroy has no weaknesses. He's the most powerful and invulnerable flame guard that has ever served in the Fire Kingdom. That does not sound good. It's not. Rumor has it he somehow got his hands on a weapon that fires powerful sound waves. He doesn't even have to touch his enemies to defeat them anymore. Lemon grab sound sword. It has to be. Yeah, we need that sword. Now we have two reasons to lay the beat down on Leroy. Maybe you guys should just give up and go home. 
I had a good run as ruler of the Fire Kingdom. Maybe it's just time I stepped aside. No way, Flame Princess. You're a totally math ruler. I'm... A... We're gonna save you. Well, okay. I just opened up the path to the east. Go ahead and scout the place out and figure out how you're going to fight Leroy. You've got a little while, but don't take too long. Once they get here, I won't have a choice but to let Leroy and his men through. Testing. Testing. One, two, three. Oh my glob! What's wrong with this thing? What the? Why is Lumpy Space Princess out here? I don't know. We've got to get her to leave or she might get hurt. LSP, you have to get out of here. There's gonna be a huge dangerous battle here any minute. No way, Fen. I was here first. What are you doing out here anyway? Singing. Duh. Seriously, LSP, you have to leave. Now! I'm not going anywhere. You and Jake just want me to lose again like last time. No lumpin' way! What are you saying? None of your lumpin' business, Jake. Keeping my set list secret this time. How much longer will you be? I mean, you really don't have much time, seriously. I don't know. The stupid speaker is broken. I can't practice with a broken speaker. The sooner it starts working, the sooner I'll be done. Okay. If we promise to help you, will you leave right after? Yeah, whatever. I'll leave if you fix the speaker and help me rehearse. Guess we don't have a choice, Jake. The faster we do what she says, the faster she'll leave. What are you guys still doing here? Fix my lumpen speaker already. All right, LSP. Your speaker's fixed. You can start rehearsing. About time. <clears throat> my lumps. I know you want a slump up on these lumps. But you can't cause you're a chump. These lumps. Ugh. That sounds awful. Ben, turn the speaker so I can hear myself better. The speaker definitely swivels, but I won't be able to move it far by hand. There, try it now. My lips, I know you want to slump up all these lips, but you can't get your shot. Ugh, it's too loud. Maybe if I step back. My lips, I know you want to slump up all these lips. But you, you can't, can't cause your no no chump. chump! Now the speaker's pointed the wrong way again, Ben! Move it! <sighs> Try it again. From the top. My lumps, I know you want to stop upon these lumps. But you can't cause your chump. Ah, uh, no! I still sound terrible. You suck at fixing speakers, Fen. That's it, I'm out of here. I cannot work with amateurs! I thought she'd never leave, dude. Yeah, but all this biz with the microphone and speaker gave me an idea of how to deal with Leroy. Flame Princess, I think we have a plan. If Leroy really has the sound sword, we can use LSP's setup to turn it against him. Let Leroy's guys through, we're ready. I sure hope so. Here they come! Prepare to taste the wrath of Leroy Flamegar! Look, Finn, we were right! He's got Lemon Grab's sound sword! Yeah, makes things interesting, doesn't it? Now, do you finally get how there could be worse things than dancing? Magic Man, you take jerkdom to a whole new level! I try, I really do. Have fun not dancing! You guys are going down from my loud waves of sound! Yeah? Bring it on, Leroy! We're ready for you! My new sound sword thingy is gonna totally wreck my
fucking sound! So good. I think I'll just rest here for a minute. Dude, that was some serious combat awesomeness. Check out all the dosh we got. <laughs> yeah, we kicked some serious booty. Well, Flame Princess, that's the last of them. You can go back to ruling the Fire Kingdom in peace. For now, at least. Fire Kingdom seems kind of unstable politics wise. Flame people are hotheads. What are you gonna do? We'd love to stay and talk, Princess, but we better get moving. Come on, Jake. It's time to head over to Castle Lemongrab. Castle Lemongrab is definitely not a happy place. Yeah, this place really creeps me out. Let's give Lemongrab their sword and get out of here. Not exactly the most inviting entrance. It's unlocked. Guess we can just go in. Lemon grab? Look what we've got! See? I told you these guys were the ones who took your noisy sword. Magic man! What the? Lemon grab, he's lying! My work here is done. <laughs> Darn you, magic man! What? My sound sword! Thieves! You stole my thing! Huh? No. You asked us to help you find it, and we did. We're bringing it back to you. You stole it, and now you come to steal more of my precious things? Theft is unacceptable! Dude, settle down. We're not here to steal your- Unacceptable! For the last time, Lemon Grab, we didn't steal your- 100 years dungeon! And my lemon peeps will recommence their lovely lemon songs from all the corners of Ooh as soon as my remote reconditioning device is ready. But you don't have any reason for them to sing. You have your sword back. You don't need to call it anymore. The sweet sounds of my lemon peeps will block out the evil dancing noise music should it ever come again. But- 100 years singing! 100 years dungeon! No parole! Whoa! Yeah! Dude has anger management issues. Whew. Now what do we do? Yeah, hopefully not end up like that, dude. A marker pen. Poor guy must have been counting his days in the dungeon. I got it. My collar. Hmm. Seems like I remember the lemon people wearing shock collars like that last time I was here with PB. That cannot be comfortable! Looks like that guy might have been trying to dig his way out. The hole's too deep. I can't reach whatever's in there. Got it! Hey! It's one of those file things! Looks like somebody started to file through the bars but gave up. The bars aren't filed down far enough for me to break them barehanded. Well, that was easy. Wonder why that dude didn't just finish the job. Cool. Cool. 